Other Brian's questions are shocking. Let's see. Yeah. It says James. Uh, this is you, good. You, it's tamed. If you want. Yeah. James, James, you have alluded to this offseason being pivotal in Troy's schedule. Is that more because of the flexibility the team will have or the players that they may be available this offseason? Um, great question, Brother Brian. Hope you're doing well. I saw I saw Brother Matthew uh, the other day, and it was good to see him. I gave him a big hug. Um, I think it's the flexibility. I think it's the potential to have another top three pick. Um, yeah, like the, the players available in terms of free agency aren't the best. But you never know what you can pull together in the trade market. I just think the Pistons have options. And to me, when you talk about the Pistons' struggles over the last decade, part of that, a large part of that is because they just didn't have options. They kind of, like, stuck themselves to one path, um, which was overpaying free agents, making a big trade on a guy who was available because he was often injured and aging, like, and that handicapped them. Like, that's kind of the issue. The Pistons have so many routes they can go. And I know it, it probably doesn't feel like that to fans, but they can continue to build through the draft uh, despite maybe fans getting impatient. They can continue – they can – they have money to spend in free agency. They have young players and and that other teams are interested in that they could trade. Like, there's, there's multiple avenues, um, and I think that's the important thing. And I also just think this offseason being pivotal, when we say that, when I say that, I also don't mean like transactionally. I think just like player development wise, like Cade's going to have a full summer to get back in the lab. Ivy's going to have a full summer after playing one season. Same with Durant. Uh, Isaiah Stewart building off what he's done this year in terms of stretching the floor. Uh, Isaiah Livers going in with a possible like defined role and defined minutes. Um, I just think it's gonna, it's just big all around and. Uh, for them to take the corner, turn the corner, they're going to need to make like a like a B acquisition, whether that's through free agency or trade. Like they need to add like a player who's like a B, my like a B at the bare minimum. Um, and I think that they go out and do that for sure. I don't know who that player will be, uh, but I certainly think that they're going to add someone uh, who is has the potential to like be a starter for this team.